Hi, this is Bob from VVSD Tech with another tech tip. You may have noticed on the Windows 7 image on your Dell Vostro laptop that the Cool Timer software is not installed. I'm going to show you three alternatives that you can have at your disposal on any machine. Okay, the first one is directly within Smart Notebook software. Okay, if you open up Smart Notebook and go to the gallery, you can search for the word timer and get these two timer tools or the word firecracker and get this timer tool. Firecracker as well, the word uh, says is that I can have a firecracker here, set the time in seconds here, click on the fuse, and it'll count down, and then as you can expect, give you a bang ending. Reset it here. Okay, this timer tool here will uh, only count down, so I can select seconds, minutes, hours, click on play, and it'll count down, and give me a beep at the end. I can reset it here, and resize it here. Okay, my favorite timer that Smart has to offer is this timer tool here. Okay, so we can count up or count down, so it can be a stopwatch or a timer. Set seconds, minutes, hours, and when you set it, click on play to have the timer go. And when the timer's done, you can have it play a custom sound as well as do some sort of follow-up action. So the sound that I had selected was cheer, the action that I selected was inject text, and I can designate what text that is. It could also be an image, or you can have it do other things like go back to the first page, go to the next page, go to the previous page, delete the timer, among other uh, tasks. You can also have the timer start automatically when this page loads. Click save to save your changes. And if you uh, have a favorite setting for your timer, for example, you always want to have it be a cheer sound. You don't want to have to set it manually every single time. Um, after you set it the one time, uh, a trick you can do is then take your timer and drag it to your My Content folder and then rename it. So this could be Kiddo Cheer Timer. Right, just to remind me that this timer will wrap up or will display the wrap it up kiddos and give a cheer when it's done. Um, and then next time I want those same settings, I can just drag this timer out rather than having to search for the word timer and drag out the default. Okay, another timer tool you can uh, use is online using any browser at onlinestopwatch.com. Okay, here I'm using it in full screen. It'll give you that option when you uh, first go to the web page. And I can count up like a stopwatch or count down like a timer. I can set it for two seconds, for example. Set and then start. Okay. And it, it'll keep flashing red until I hit clear. And then it'll go back to the timer that I had set. So if I'm doing quick 30 second intervals, I don't have to keep resetting it for 30 seconds. I can just keep clicking on start um, or I can hit clear and go back to choose a new timer. Okay, the last timer you have at your disposal is through Chrome. In Google Chrome, if I search within the Omnibox, the word timer and then the time that I want, 30 seconds, two seconds, five seconds, one minute, 30 seconds, whatever time interval you'd like, and then search, it'll give you a timer within Google browser. For that time, it'll automatically go, and that beeping won't stop until I hit OK. If I don't want a beeping at all, I can mute it. And if I want to reset back to five seconds, I can click on reset. Okay, and again, it'll go automatically for me. And there you go.